Hello, boys and girls. Here's another video that I'm doing to celebrate Earth Week. Now, when I did that hike out in the park at Crown Ridge, I showed you some wild grapevine. And I said, oh, they don't have any grapes on them. Well, this is my grapevine. And if you look, there's these tiny little grapes. And there's a bunch of them. And they'll grow to be big grapes. And they're edible. They're, not, they're, pretty, they're pretty sweet, but a little bit tart. So to celebrate Earth Day today, I'm going to show you my backyard. Because even in your backyard, you could celebrate Earth Week. You might have some potted plants or some trees or grass growing in your backyard or birds flying around. So we're going to walk around and look and just see. Some of this you've seen before. Beautiful impatia by the fountain. And you see that spider grass up there. And then, of course, the beautiful foxtail right here. And there's some white bougainvilleas with a shrimp plant as we walk along. Oh, look at this. We've got this strange sculpture. These two crazy creatures are taking off the garden gnome, poor gnome. And then, of course, there's this crazy little alligator. So we walk along. Here's a hummingbird feeder. And we do have hummingbirds come to our backyard. They come in and they put their little beaks there. They even put their beaks in the shrimp plant, too. It's a beautiful yellow and purple pansy. Some more impatience. We're going to try to go upstairs and look around up there. Hey, look. I've got some more crazy sculptures. My little owl. My little turtle. And oh, my poor little one-eyed cat. He must have been a tomcat. Now we go upstairs. I've got to be a little careful as I go upstairs. I don't want to fall down. And I'm working my way up. We're going to stop right here. Okay, boys and girls. Now, this week we celebrate Earth Day and Arbor Day. And you may say, what's Arbor Day? Arbor Day is an old holiday. It's kind of like Earth Day. But it celebrates trees. And I've got lots of nice big trees in my backyard. Got this beautiful, these beautiful live oaks. I've got that cedar tree over there, and this tall tree right here that goes way up. That's a cedar elm. It goes really high. And then my sister-in-law gave me some seeds and I planted them. And this is an orange tree. I'm keeping my fingers crossed that I'll grow some orange trees. This is the mountain laurel. It usually comes out with beautiful purple flowers. This is my peach tree. It looks kind of not there yet, another live oak. And back over there behind is my neighbor's fig tree. I think I've told you about this fig tree. So now we're gonna go downstairs and look at one more thing, but we do have to be careful. As I go down, you can see this wonderful creeping vine. It's covering up the whole backyard, this back part of the yard. This back part of the yard, I kind of just leave alone and let it be like a jungle. Here we go to this small patio area. Here's this beautiful sago palm. A lot of people grow these. And this is the jasmine and has the wonderful white flowers. Now you kind of have to be quiet when you're over here because at night a bunch of little birds, they fly inside here and they sleep. That's where they hide. And if I make too much noise, they all, they'll all fly out. And then of course I've got some tropical plants over there. But before I leave, and before we stop, this is before the end of Earth Week, we also need to talk about what normally happens at this time of year in San Antonio. It's Fiesta. And we get all these medals and stuff. And we've collected these medals over the years. It's kind of sad that we can't celebrate Fiesta now, but we have to be safe. But we're supposed to celebrate Fiesta in November. And we'll probably get to celebrate Fiesta in November and in April. So we'll have like two Fiestas. So that'll be really good. So as I sign off, I want to say two things. Viva Fiesta and Viva Earth Week. Be safe.